Yeah. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Trey Soldier. Look, I was supposed to watch this video in the last video, but we got LD2K. You know what I'm saying? And Shakedown, I don't, I don't even remember who that nigga is. I have no idea. But I don't know what this video is on, but let's see. What's up, everyone? Chris Manning here, host of 2K TV and your affiliate NBA 2K leader for Elite. One of two affiliations, 2K TV and your affiliation leader for Elite. So he's an uh, affiliation leader for Elite. If Ronnie is the leader for the other team, it might be reps. One of two affiliations that are going head to head in NBA 2K24. Do you know who it is? It's your boy Shake here, representing affiliation Rise. So there's only two parks, Elite and Rise, and that's what I'm guessing. Always good to see you, Shake. Always Absolutely. good to see you. You'll get to choose. Hey, bro. Elevate your team. Okay, Rise. Brand new heat check gameplay boost. Get rewarded for your hot hand from the perimeter after knocking down some outside shots. Finishing boost. Okay, play making boost. Brand new two way tenacity defense boost shooting boost. Want the ball in your hands for the last shot? Lead is for you. Earn unique gameplay boost towards defense and shooting. Elevate your team. Earn unique gameplay towards finishing and playmaking. Well, I'm trying to be a shooter, bro. Uh, and that's like. Defense and shooting together is kind of crazy, bro. So. And a permanent boost to your shooting attributes? Green by any means? Okay. Uh, well, we elite. Which affiliation we are elite. Join in NBA 2K24? And okay, so Rise is the octopus. Elite is. Rises are on the line oh, for the winning affiliations each season. So you are these actually season rewards. Anchor, player indicator. Want to choose wisely? We'll start with. Wait, what did he even say, bro? Affiliation you join in NBA. I'm not K fucking listening. And prizes are on the line for the winning affiliations each season, so you'll want to choose wisely. For the we'll winning start with my affiliation, affiliation, elite. All right, talk to me. We're focused on defense and shooting, so not only do we have limitless range, but we lock down on defense. Plus, who doesn't love hooping on these beautiful neon lights? And check this out. Our courts will actually elevate you to another level. You get that? Because you'll levitate up. You don't got that, man. So find me in the city in NBA 2K24 and lace them up for elite. Nah, nah, nah. Rise is where it's at. We're focused on finishing and playmaking. We make the highlight reels in the city. I'm always a slash, I might go rise. As your leader for Rise in NBA 2K24, not only are we winning this rivalry against my good friend LD and Elite, but we're also gonna be balling in style. Once you see our beautiful Atlantis themed courts, you'll never look back. And we even have an underwater court to hoop on that's unlike anything you've ever seen. Nigga, a seahorse fucking. <laughs> this time. That shit kinda cold, bro. That shit's kinda cold. This is where the best will always be going down in the city it's true this is where the best hoop action will always be going down in the city okay. so go find me in nba 2k they said this time it's true ready to rise huh, up niggas bring up the fact that ronnie capped so the choice is yours but here's where it gets real each affiliation has its own rep yes you heard us correctly rep is back and we all hmm. know that bragging rights are important in the 2k community and in nba 2k24 your status as the greatest player in the city is on the line grind your way to becoming one of the best players in the city and reach the top 10 tier and what's even better is your rep doesn't reset at the season's end you join an affiliation start at rookie one rep level and grind your way up the ladder all year long team elite nah rise Next, let's talk about badges. Upgrading your badges in NBA 2K24 is all based how long is, uh, I got two more on minutes. how you play. For example, if you have the corner specialist badge and you're dropping threes from the corner and getting those greens, your badge progress will actually upgrade over time. So you get a bronze badge and then if you, the more you use it, the more, the higher the level gets. 
But how quick are these going down and going up, bro? Like, that's my question. One thing that's important to remember about badges in my career and in the city is that you have to continue to use them because if you deviate from your current play style and you stop using the badge as often as you used to, your badge may regress. So Nigga. you really want to make sure that you build a player that can complement your play style. Now it's time to get out there and play to your strengths. Should we uh, tell them about street ball too? Oh, oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Street do ball. That, do that. So Talk check this to me. out. If you need more takeover perks for your my player and part games, then you can take your game to the streets. The new single player side quests in the city bring the street ball experience to life. Shake, let them know, man. There are three courts in the city that have unique court bosses and teams to defeat. Each court comes with its own environment filled with MCs, Man. DJs, and a rowdy courtside crowd. With its own progression system, there are several takeover perks for you to unlock for your My Player. And don't sleep on the competition because if you don't ball out, fans will rush the court and shut it down. So you tell me you play against AIs? And if you lose to the AI, the fans are gonna rush the court. Is that what I'm hearing right now? NBA 2K24 is all about communities and representing your affiliation. So squat up a crossplay, grab a cold drink, and we'll see you on the courts. Your time has come, baller. Now I ask you this: Who will you choose? Yeah, bro. Um, I don't know, bro. Well, I'm I'm gonna pick a lead because I'm gonna probably be a shooter. Well, now I will be a shooter. It's no point of being a a slashing point guard. Um, rise. What was it? Um, fucking slashing and playmaking. So, uh, it's tough, bro. Everyone in the rise is going to be throwing alley-oop, fucking windmill booms. And then, everyone in the lead is going to clamp that shit up and fucking shoot over the head of them. Type shit. What's this? Wow. I mean, do you ever think this will be top? Uh, uh, you know, in this lifetime. No. But, uh. Okay have accomplished something no one in this organization has ever done before. A lot of those guys played in a different era, though. <sighs> You're hungry, and, and backboards in the city? But part of the reason this game continues to evolve is because of players like you. Talk to me. Compete in our invite only 2K24 local gauntlet and battle it out for the... What's this? Half a mil? I think you've got the skills competing in our invite only high stakes NBA 2K24 logo gauntlet and battle it out for the coveted in game 2K logo. Secure five consecutive wins in the King of the Hill style competition and you'll earn the grand prize. What's these rules? Uh, format each team. Just six teams and five matches playing. Player must own or have access to the game on PlayStation or Xbox. <sighs> Idea. So, Xbox Live. Player must play on the same account. Players must be capable and willing to live stream their point of view of the gameplay. During any match on Twitch and or YouTube. Live stream their point. Players must join the official NBA 2K community Discord. <laughs> Fuck this. I got him. Good luck to those people though, I guess. That's the most recent thing they posted. Alright then. Oh. Hopefully the game's good, bro. Hopefully.